Step number four of the anti-slice system is the club face. Now, what do I mean by that? It's about allowing the club face to release closed. Now, this is the most important aspect of the anti-slice system. It is the cause of slices. Let me repeat that. Step number four, the club face and the ability to release the club face closed is the number one culprit behind slicing. Okay, so get that clear in your mind as you understand this step. Now, let me explain to you what we mean and what we're trying to get you to do with the club face when we talk about release. So, what you'll see with, with most slices is this type of motion. They will stand there and from here, they will hold the face open through the hitting area. So from this angle, as they go through, they will be in this type of position. You may have heard of the sort of chicken wing. The club face is now very, very open and pointing up to the sky. When you release the club, what you'll get is the club face closing over and this, the end of the pull up will now point more towards the ball target line here. Now, let me give you a drill that'll help you to get this sensation. Just with your alignment stick, put the alignment stick against your club grip the club and the alignment stick. Now from here, just do a few practice swings where you come through and you can see very clearly where this is now pointing more at the ball line. Now this is you now releasing the club. The club is now closing, which will encourage more of the shape of the draw. Now, if you are doing this, which is what most slicers do, the face is left open through tension, holding on tight, they're worried about where the ball's gonna go, they don't release it at all, they end up with the face open, this stick you can see is now pointing over here somewhere. So what we're after again is this, get the club releasing, close the club into this position. So what I would encourage you to really work on as well is more from a three quarter to three quarter position. You can see here, three quarter back, three quarter through, three quarter back, three quarter through. Okay, that's what we'd like to see. You can see that I've got this full hinge and release back, three quarter, through three quarter, rather than here and holding off at a very different angle. So the key here is get the club releasing, get the club face closing through, through the hitting area and beyond. Now, as I've said, this is the culprit. This is the main thing behind a slice. We have got to get you closing that club, get the release to here. Don't have yourself in this position with the club face well open. We want to get you here where it's now closed and released. So work on that drill. It's step number four. It's all about the club face. It's about release the club, close the club. And remember, this is hugely linked to tension. Free it up, work on the three quarter swing I've just shown you and use the stick as your guide just to try and match the stick on the ball line rather than pointing up to the sky somewhere. Okay, so good luck with that. That was step number four.